we're really excited to be out today. We're at Peregrine. We're with Martin Taylor here, and he's going to introduce to us what you're doing. Your new facility, yep. new machines. Tell yep. us a little bit about it. Well, we've been here uh, since last year, about probably eight, ten months. Right. Uh, we've got two machines uh, at the moment, uh, a lathe and a, and a, a yeah, this center. is the new, the new, the new CV5500. Oh, okay. It's uh, one of the first uh, to be in the country. Wow, okay. So, uh, yeah, it's very, very excited to have that one. Uh, it's full five axis, so it gives us a lot of opportunities to yeah, I was going to say, lots lot. of facilities to do yeah. different types of components. Yeah, different types and of components. And the state of the art equipment. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And, uh, you know, whereas before you'd have it two, three, four maybe operations, Brilliant. this cuts it down to one, maybe two sometimes. Uh, time and, you, and you've got another addition coming as well? We right? have, yeah. We've got a, uh, another Mazak, uh, big, big machine, machine wow. centre. Wow. So okay. that should be coming in September time. Great. So, right. yeah, exciting time. Right. New facility, and great to hear you're getting the coolant savers on board as well. Yes, yes. Which is exciting and great. I, I guess tell us a little bit about that region. Yeah, well, I've used the coolant savers before, uh, yeah. somewhere else where I was working, yeah, and uh, it. yeah, it, it was great. great you know, saves, saves time, saves, yeah. you know, uh, the person uh, drain out all the oil, yeah. putting it back into the machine, it's done Fantastic. automatically. And I guess a new facility, you want to keep it all clean. Yeah. All definitely. right then, well, that's great. Let's go and have a look at the coolant saver. The installation of the coolant saver is in place. It's doing its job. Now, the coolant saver installation is really straightforward and very quick to do. We've actually installed it from the standard around spindle pump and then we've installed it and put our T-branch into the unit and then the unit then is automatically on when the machine is switched on. So once it's all set and installed, the machine's running, it will automatically turn on. There won't be anybody requirement to turn on or off and that oil that is dragged over with the swarf into the swarf bin, the oil will automatically be sucked up and reclaimed back up into the system and back into the sump. So all that valuable resource of that oil being taken away is automatically reclaimed back into the machine, therefore saving a lot of oil, a lot of manpower, a lot of disposal, and making it an automated process. Well, it's been really great visiting Peregrine today. Great to see their new facility, the new machines and investments, and also the consideration about putting the coolant saver on the machine, saving the oil, keeping the area clean, and environmentally it's great. Well, Martin, I'd like to say a big thank you for today. Yeah, no problem. Great time. Glad, glad you came in today and uh, feared it for us. I'm looking forward to you coming back in and doing the other machines. Doing the other ones to save yeah. more oil and cooling. Yeah. That's brilliant. Thanks, Martin. No worries.